Hello everybody and welcome back to more of Pokemon Leaf Green. Boy, it has been what a month since I recorded this, my lord. Anyways, last time we did some stuff here on Four Island including battling Team Rocket grunts and Lorelei was involved as well. In this episode, we're actually going to be heading to Five Island. We are we were on Four Island, I should say, but we're going to be heading to Five Island because that's where the Team Rocket warehouse that we got hinted about in the last episode is located at. So, let's get traveling across the Seven Seas. Alright, and here we are. No, I didn't want to sail again. My god, I already made that mistake in my quality test video for the Blue Yeti. Anyways, uh, what is there to do on Five Island besides the Team Rocket warehouse? Because... I haven't really paid attention to loca other locations on the islands other than important stuff. I guess just because my OCD wants me to uh, just finish up the game. Although I shouldn't really say that because I like to do pointless stuff in the other after games of my Pokemon Let's Plays. And I should breathe once in a while while I'm talking. A meadow and a weird building. All right. Chrono Island, where the time goes. Interesting. Is there anything in here besides this old man? The meadows long, generations... Okay. Well, there's nothing. I guess that's why I don't go in these houses on these islands, because there's nothing for me. Lesson learned. Anyways, let's head over here. The Five Isle Meadow. Okay. You can take a shortcut. Oh, no, that's actually not a shortcut. It's uh, to an item. Alright, Needle King, cut that down. Let's go grab this item. It is a max potion. Alright, I'll take it. And I guess I'll take the wild Pokemon battle. Oh, and this is the introduction of wild Pokemon that are not native to this game normally. This is Hoppip from Generation 2. Uh, it's level 10. Do I have any Pokeballs? Because we'll just... Yeah, we have. We have over 100 of them, so we should be fine. It's only level 10 as well. Has an e easy catch rate. Oh, I thought it had an easy catch rate. I guess not. Uh, I'm not going to waste more time here in the episode. Thanks for coming, Hoppip. Uh... I guess I'll see you whenever I let's play Heart Gold and Soul Silver. Alright, and before I forget, and before I fight Team Rocket Grunts, let's spray a Max Repel. Oh god, I made this mistake last time as well. There you go, it's right there when you scroll to it. And now it's time to fight. This area strictly off limits. Out! Out! Alright, here we go. This Team Rocket Grunt has three Pokemon. Out first is a Rattata. Go, Poliwrath! Although the surprise about Poliwrath being up front isn't there anymore due to the Wild Hoppip. Let's just use Brick Break. You should have evolved that Rattata by now, buddy. Uh, it deserved to be Eradicate a long time ago. There we go, thanks for coming, Rattata. High-leveled Pokemon compared to mine. Mine aren't that high-leveled anymore compared to anybody. Alright, next up's Grimer. Let's switch out to Executor. Super effectiveness and all is helpful. Alrighty. So, hello, Grimer. You should have evolved as well by now. Let's use Psychic. I was getting a little bit worried there that it wasn't going to take it out, but... No worries whatsoever. There you go, some experience for Snorlax as well. Next up is Muck. We will be staying in. And once again, we will be using Psychic. Oh wow, we actually even took out the Muck. Hmm. That's weird. It seemed like it wasn't going to take it out. Anyways, we have defeated this Team Rocket Grunt. Is this for real? Alright, there you go. One down, and one more at least to go. I need to actually fight you. You'd be wasting time, even if you were to get by me. Alright, this Team Rocket Grunt also has three Pokemon, and out first is an Ekans. Once again, go Poliwrath. And that Intimidate is going to hinder us if we didn't have special moves, and we have two of them, so it's not gonna matter. There you go, Surf takes out Ekans, 
Alright, and next up for the Rocket Grunt is going to be Gloom. So we will switch out and we will go into Charizard. Because Charizard hasn't seen a little bit of action in a while. Quite frankly, all of my Pokemon haven't seen much action in like the last month. Alright, let's use Flamethrower. And there goes Gloom. I assume since the other guy had it, the evolved form of his second Pokemon, you will as well. So, are we going to be facing Vileplume next? No, another Gloom. Oh, that's sad. Alright, stay in with Charizard. I was going to stay in anyway. Alright, and once again, use Flamethrower. And there we go. Thanks for coming, Gloom. And that is going to do it for this battle against this Team Rocket Grunt. Oh, that makes me furious! Alright, there we go. Oh, there is one more, okay. Is that it then after this guy? There's nothing past here except our warehouse. So what brings you here? Alright, here we go. This Rocket Grunt has two Pokemon. First up is Coughing. Let's go, Poliwrath. Alright, and let's just use Surf to take care of you right away. Thanks for coming, Coughing. And the final Pokemon is going to be, I already know, it's Weezing. Alright, we will be switching out and we will go into... Let's go into Snorlax. Snorlax is our lowest level. He could use some experience. Well... Not second-hand experience. More like, uh, first-hand experience. Anyway, uh, let's go for a Fire Blast. Sludge. Hmm. Luckily, we have immunity, so we can't get poisoned from it. Fire Blast actually hit this time, which is great. Half damage. Hmm. How about we try a Body Slam? Smoke Screen. I'm surprised we haven't exploded by now. Accuracy fell, but we hit Body Slam anyway. Excellent. And there goes Weezing. So, level 53 now for Snorlax. Uh, first-hand experience. Yummy. Alrighty, Snorlax wants to learn Hyper Beam. Oh boy, this could do serious damage, but uh, I don't know if I want to get rid of Yawn. Uh, let's just stick with it all normal moveset. Fire Blast is basically the Hyper Beam for fire types. So, get rid of Fire Blast and learn Hyper Beam. And... That is going to do it. The text didn't show up for a split second really weirdly. This Team Rocket Grunt. That wasn't supposed to happen. Okay. Yes, I want to know what's inside the warehouse. Am I really going to have to go through this? Goldini log. Yeah, I need another password. Where is the other password? Can I... Can I please get the other password? Do you have the other password? Okay. Yes, I know. Passwords. They're important. Please, can I have the other one? Oh god, I need to remember how to get the other password. Oh no. I forgot. What do I do? Well, it looks like we can't do anything else here on Five Island quite yet. But we do have two other islands to explore, and I guess we'll figure out what to do with the rocket warehouse in the other islands, I don't know. Anyways, for now, let's just set sail once again, and let's go to Six Island. We'll go in numerical order. Why not? Alrighty. So, now, we are in Six Island. I wish you could run in that building, but I guess not. Let's see what this sign says. Fortune Island! Okay. Okay, what do you have to say, Hiker? The Water Path. Ruin Valley. Hmm. Interesting. What's in this house here? Another old man! <laughs> Young people and their excitement. Okay. Repel War Off. We'll have to spray another one if we're going to be heading to a path area. Oh, there, there we go. Water Path. Ooh. Hidden Secrets? What's behind here? Weppa Berry. Okay. Now let's head back over near the water path. That guy's just staring into oblivion over there. Leads to Ruin Valley. Okay. 
Well, let's go into our bag really quickly, spray another Max Repel. I should probably put that Leftovers on somebody, but I kind of don't want to. Ooh, a hidden item right here. It's a Panab Berry. Pineab, Panab, whatever. However, however you pronounce your vowels. Ooh, there's another one. It's an Asper Berry. Okay. I kind of don't want to battle anybody, so can you please turn, Hiker? You're not going to turn, are you? Okay, you are going to turn. Eh, don't turn again. Okay. I'll battle all these people off screen. I don't feel like battling them now. Ruin Valley. Okay. Well, if we do have to face some people required, then I will do it. Oh, that's blocked. Okay. There are a lot of new Pokemon in here. Uh, during the after game, I kind of don't really want to do the Pokemon up here in the root thing because the after game really is just like the last step. And <laughs> to be honest, I don't really want to do more editing than I should have. Uh, even though this is a shorter after game than <laughs> compared to the recent ones. Uh, but that's fine. I just won't keep doing that. Okay, oh god. Whoa, what's that over there? Ooh, is that where we need to head? Hmm. Oh no. Okay. Play smart about this. I'm gonna spray another repel, because I assume there's gonna be more grass coming up. Okay. Turn. There we go. Wow! He turned back right away as soon as he turned that way. Jeez, man, why do you gotta do that to me? You see, you ruined Maniac, you ruined everything for me, so you do not deserve to be in this video. I'm gonna cut your battle out. Okay. Well, we're at this area here. Yeah, let's check it more thoroughly. Uh... Oh god. Braille. I think... It says cut? It's either cut or flash or strength, if I rem Okay, it was cut! Okay, let's go then! The dotted hole. Hmm. Well, what else can- Okay, we can't do anything else here. Okay, drop down the hole. Okay. Well, that's only... Two letters, so up. Four letters, so it's either down or left. Uh... Uh... Take a risk! Go left! That's right, because that's five letters. And I'm just going to go down because I haven't gone that way yet. Well, we did it! Here's our next gem. It is the Sapphire! All right. Uh-oh. What is this? <laughs> I guessed right. I was right in telling you. I knew that there was a sapphire here, so it belongs to me. I'll sell it to Team Rocket for serious money. T don't glare at me like that. If you want it back, why don't you go get it after I sell it? I'll even tell you one of the passwords to Team Rocket's warehouse. The warehouse password I know is yes, not chancy. I'm done. Don't think badly of me. You scumbag scot- I'm going after him. Okay, um... Well, I guess we have two passwords to the rocket warehouse now, so... We can go there? Uh, Five Island, fly that way. Oh no, that's Six Island, derp. Charizard, please. Can we even fly to Five Island? I actually should have checked. Probably gonna have to take the boat. No, not summary. Charizard. Buttons, please. No, that leads to Seven Island. Oh, great. So we're gonna have to travel by sea anyway. Okay. Well, let's get out of here then. We're gonna go to Other and we'll go to Five Island. Alright, so... We know the other password now, that's great. Probably should have went to Six Island before we explored the rocket warehouse, but, you know, I didn't know, I didn't know any better. Anyways, I'm gonna heal out the Pokemon Center really quickly, and we'll be back and head to the rocket warehouse. Alright, the Pokemon are all healed up, and now we have both passwords. 
Goldini Blog, Yes Not Chancy. And the warehouse door has opened. Alright, let's head inside. Oh yay, more tiles! Just what I wanted. Okay, let's go this way. And... Is there any way we can get these items here, I wonder? Okay, we can get one at least. It's the big pearl. Okay. We can probably get the others, it's just a matter of... the right timing, what tiles to go to. Stuff like that. I kind of don't want to face you. Thanks for the upgrade. That gives us the... Uh, no! Should've stayed to the left. Oh, now your Pokémon look strong. You're willing to sell them? Oh? You wanted to battle? Alright, this Team Rocket Grunt has two Pokémon. I kind of didn't want to face you, though. First up is a Houndour. Pokémon from Johto that we are seeing for the first time here in this game. Alright, let's use Surf. Part Fire-type, so it takes it out. Thanks for coming, puppy. Next up is going to be... The... Oh, I was going to say the evolved form of Houndour, but no, you only have two Houndours. One's not so grown up yet. Okay. Another surf. It's been a while since I did the after game of Leaf Green, so you gotta excuse me. And there goes the second Hound Hour. Alright, and that is going to do it for this battle against this Team Rocket Grunt. Oh, but too much. Alright, thanks for coming. How do we get the other items? I would assume this way... no. Oh, maybe... oh, uh, yep, this is how we get this one over here, don't walk up yet. Alright, and here's another pearl, although this one's not as big. Okay, and now, just head over here again. Took that one, it led to there, so go over here. Oh wait, that led to the same area, okay. Um... Okay, go back this way. And head down this one again. There we go. Now this guy... Uh, well, we're gonna battle him first, I guess. Did you come here knowing it's Team Rocket's warehouse? Yes, because another one of you grunts told me that there was a warehouse on Five Island. <laughs> Stupid grunt. Alright, this Rocket Grunt has three Pokémon. First up is Machop. Go Poliwrath! I should switch my Pokémon around, really. Uh, let's go for Waterfall. Spice things up a bit. Get, uh, give Surf a break. Alright, Machop. Thanks for coming. Next up is going to be... Machop. Alright, we will switch out and we will go into Jolteon. My goal for this episode is to get all of my Pokémon on this video. So, Poliwrath, Snorlax, Executor, and Charizard have appeared, so that just leaves Nidoking, eventually. Alright, let's go for Shockwave. And thanks for coming, Machop. Alright. More experience for Snorlax, which is appreciated. Next up is Machoke. And why don't we give Nidoking that battle right now? Alrighty. Let's go for... hmm... Let's just go for an Earthquake. Oh, it didn't take it out. That's, I guess, fine. Because we're only five levels higher than it. I was hoping for the Poison Touch to kick in, but... Poison Point? Poison Touch? What am I... I'm thinking of the... There's so many abilities to get them mixed up now. Anyway, let's go for a Mega Horn to finish off Machoke. Thanks for coming. And I believe that was this Grunt's final Pokémon, so... Yes, it is. Thanks for coming, Team Rocket Grunt Battle. 
wrong send off. Blasting off again. Okay. Uh. Go. This way. Okay, we already went that way. Great. So now we gotta do this all over again. Wonderful. And the, the right answer is going to be this one. And then this way. Wait a minute, no it's not. Oh god. This is so confusing. Why do I keep spinning? I don't know why I do this to myself. Okay. This way. Okay, I managed to make my way up from this way to there. So, let's try going this way. That didn't really work out. I think I see the way to go. Like, the panel behind the box, like that way, though that row, but there's the down one to the left of that. So that would ruin the pattern. Oh god, I wish I knew which way to go. This is so confusing me right now. God, I'm stupid. Okay. I just need to be careful going this way. Here's a netball. Thanks, random box. Now, oh god. Just need to be careful going this way. Yeah, there you go. That's how you do it. My god. TM36 Sludge Bomb. Hmm, that'll be useful. Okay, go this way. There we go. Fight this rocket grunt. I got word about you from the others. That literally took me five minutes to figure out. Yes, I am that stupid. There's no way a kid like you would know our boss, Giovanni. Alright, this rocket grunt has two Pokemon out. First is Hypno. Alright, let's go, Polyrath. This is a bad matchup because you're psychic type. Let's go for Waterfall. Thank God we're faster. And that did nothing at all. This psychic is going to hurt. Oh boy. Oh, that didn't do too bad. That wasn't too bad. How about a surf? I almost said brick break. Brick break would literally do nothing to Hypno. Wow, it survived again and swagger. Oh boy. Uh, we're we might have to switch out here. Just because I don't want Polyrath to faint, because I don't know what's coming up ahead. Okay. Uh, let's go with Snorlax. Snorlax is pretty bulky, defensively and special defensively, so it shouldn't really matter what move it uses. We should be able to tank it pretty well. Case in point, look at that, 38 damage only. Take a seat, Hypno. Swagger, we used the move before it used Swagger, so we should be fine. Usually that's the little thing with confusion. If you use a move before it happens, then you should hit it. Hopefully I don't jinx myself. Yay, we didn't jinx ourselves. And down goes Hypno. Critical hit that was not needed at all. <laughs> Whatsoever. That was not needed. Next up's another Hypno. We will switch out and we will go into Jolteon. Although I should have went into Nidoking and used Megahorn now that I think about it, but hopefully this thunder will hit, and indeed, it does. Hypno is a pretty strong Pokemon, though. It can take a lot of pretty powerful hits before it goes down. So if you're looking for a Psychic type when you play the first generation or second generation, whenever Drowsy or Hypno is available, I'd recommend them, because they are pretty strong. Pretty underrated, actually. And we hit the Shockwave! It never misses. Except confusion, sometimes. Anyway, down goes Hypno, which means that is going to do it for this battle against this Team Rocket Grunt. Don't you dare laugh! Alright, thanks for coming, Rocket Grunt. And we are finally at this point. This seems like the end. We have a female grunt to battle, and then there's a grunt, I guess, at a desk. I don't know or care if what I'm doing is right or wrong. I just put my faith in Giovanni, 
and do as I am told. Alright, this Rocket Grunt has three Pokémon! First up is a Muck! Go Polyrath! Wow, pretty high-level Muck. Okay, um... I'm gonna go into my Pokémon. I'm, I'm gonna go into my Pokémon! I'm gonna... <coughs> Jesus. Uh, we will go into Snorlax, just because we can't get poisoned in case it uses a Poison-type move. Minimize, okay. That's not bad, I guess. Your evasiveness did rise, though. Let's try out Hyper Beam. This is the first time we're going to be using Hyper Beam, although you've basically seen the fire equivalent, and of course we missed because of the evasiveness. Wonderful. Minimize again. Oh, just what I needed. You might as well just use Substitute Muck. Could Muck even learn Substitute? I don't know. Hyper Miss. Hyper Miss. Just like Stone Miss can Focus Miss. Come on. Come on, Hyper Beam. No, of course not! Yay! We only have two uses left of it already, which is wonderful. I mean, it's not like I didn't want to use it. I didn't want to use it, Snorlax, that's fine! I mean... You know, just want to show the viewers and you're just all... Oh, thank God! Finally! Good Lord. And it didn't even take it out! What the f- And of course, Body Slam misses. Minimize again. Wonderful. And Body Slam actually hit this time. Great. Didn't paralyze. Beautiful. Snorlax is nearly dead. Just great. And Snorlax is now dead. 10 out of 10. Would recommend. Okay, now back to being serious. Let's send in Executor. And let's use Psychic. Down goes Muck. Thanks for coming. Experience for everybody except Snorlax, because Snorlax is a butt. Anyway, Arbok is up next, so we will stay in. Our attack is going to lower thanks to Intimidate from Arbok, but guess what? Psychic is a special move. Sludge Bomb's going to hurt, though. Four times super effective! Oh my goodness. At least we didn't get Psychic. That would have been adding salt to the wounds, and that would have been horrible. Alright, thanks for coming, Arbok! And one more Pokemon is left for the Rocket Grunt. It is Vileplume. Now Vileplume shows up. Alright, let's just... Stay in, and we will use Psychic once more. And thanks for coming, Vileplume. Alright, so that is going to do it for this battle against this, Team Rocket Grunt. I'm... I'm shattered. You're doing things according to your beliefs and morals. I understand now. I've made it so you can come back in through here. Why don't you go get rested and refreshed for what lies ahead? The admin after me outranks me thoroughly as a trainer. You'd better steal yourself for one harsh challenge. A harsh challenge, eh? Let's go for it! That's quite enough of you playing the hero, kid. Spreading lies about how Team Rocket has disbanded? It's such an obvious attempt to cause confusion in our ranks. Fortunately, we are not so ignorant to fall for the lies of a child. And now... I'll show you how scary an angry adult can be!
And here we go against this Team Rocket admin, who is dressed just like a grunt. Who has three Pokemon? First up is Golbat. And this is supposed to be a challenge according to the female grunt we just battled. So far, not seen it though. Blizzard misses! Why not? Why would you hit? Not at all. Mmm. Beautiful start to a battle. And we're confused too. This is just... This is... This is 10 out of 10. I mean, why not? Hurt ourselves too. Bravo. Clap, clap. Air Cutter is most likely going to be taking... Oh, now we actually survived. Can we hit a blizzard, please, before we die? Of course not. We broke through the confusion, but... Nope, not gonna hit Blizzard. And down goes Polyrath. Alright, let's go for Jolteon. And let's hit a Shockwave, because Shockwave will never miss. Thank God! Oh, it actually survived. Confused Ray again, you trollish Golbat, I swear. You make all my Pokemon faint because I can't hit you whatsoever. I'm going to be so mad. The admin's gonna use a Hyper Potion. Alright, hopefully... Jolteon can actually hit Shockwave. No, of course not. Thanks, Confusion Hacks. Beautiful. Let's try it again. There we go, we actually hit this time. Great. And that actually survived with more HP than it did the last time I used, uh, th uh Thunder Wave? <laughs> yeah, we're totally paralyzing it. Oh, God. Poison. This is bad. Shockwave, please, don't- Oh, God. You're gonna hit yourself, aren't you, Jolteon? Yes, you're going to hit yourself! Please, why?! Oh, my God! Wow! Okay! Um, Executor, please, don't die. <laughs> please go first. Be faster than a bat. Unlikely. Oh, this is bad. I probably should have healed up. Yeah, this is gonna be bad. Okay. Needle King and Charizard are left. We Needle King, let's go. At least you're part poison. You can't get hurt by poison types. Okay, Leftover is gonna help you out a bit. Which is great, because you need leftovers. Uh, let's go for Mega Horn. Yay, we finally hit a move in this battle. Not gonna even take you out. Okay, that's just great. Air Cutter. Oh, that's... Okay. For a second I thought Poison Point was activating, but... Okay. Horn Attack. Please take it out. I'll be so upset. Thank you for taking it out, Needle King. My god. You deserve all that experience. Oh god, next up is Weezing. Oh, we'll stay in. It's probably gonna explode on us. Leftovers for Nido King is welcomed because you're going to need it, especially if it explodes. Uh, will an earthquake hit it? No, it won't. Levitate, darn it. Oh, and there goes Nido King. Due to explosion. Oh, this is so bad. One Pokemon left for each of us. This is going to be fun to find out how much trouble I'm in. It's a Houndoom. I think I'll be able to take it out with Dragon Claw. Okay, this could work. Crunch, though, is going to... Oh, Crunch does more, and my defense got... Uh, special defense got lowered. Alright, we're gonna go for Fly, just so it can't touch us for at least one turn. Okay, it's gonna stick with Crunch. Okay, let's see how much Fly will do. Okay, Fly does more- Oh, it almost took it out! Okay. I know I'm faster than this thing. WHAT?! HOW?! Oh my god. Okay, let's try this again. Here we go against the Team Rocket and Min. Golbat, we already saw you before. I don't like you. Alright, Shockwave, Jolteon out front first. Let's do this.
Oh, you survived with yellow this time. And once again, you decided to use Confuse Ray. That's just great. I probably should have tried Thunder, although Thunder would have missed on me. And I don't want that. Hyper Potion. Just great. We're getting into the tough part already. Wonderful. And it hurt itself. That's just great. I, I want that so much. Thank you, Golbat, for this wonderful present known as Confusion. We actually hit the Shockwave, though, which is great because that'll be a huge relief. Especially if Golbat ends up taking out Jolteon. Sludge Bomb, this is going to hurt. Please don't poison me like last time. Thank you. Can I break out of Confu- No. Can I hit the move? Yes! Yay! We finally take out Golbat, and we didn't lose a Pokemon or two this time! Just great. Thank you, Jolteon. Oh, You deserve a rest so badly. Next up is Weezing. We will switch out. We'll go into Executor, try to take this thing out before it tries to explode. Hopefully we're faster than a giant pile of waste. Although that's actually technically muck than a walking... Um... <laughs> a walking radiation ball. Okay, so let's just do Psychic. Thank goodness we're faster. And we took it out! Oh, this battle is going so much better. We probably should have healed up like the lady said, but we didn't because we're stupid. And last up, Town Doom. Let's switch out and go into Polyrath and just get this thing over with once and for all. Alright, and let's go for Surf. Shadow Ball actually hits first from Houndoom. Which, okay, that didn't do too much. So we have nothing really to worry about unless it gets an Ultra Critical. Or it survives with 1 HP. Wow, he didn't heal up. I guess he only had one Hyper Potion. That works out well for us. Finish it off with Waterfall, Polyrath. Thanks for coming, Houndoom. And that is going to do it for this battle. Against this. Level 54 Snorlax? No, against this. Team Rocket. Admin. Ugh. You were too strong. That's Giovanni's badge. So it's true. Team Rocket really has disbanded. We will abandon this warehouse. But don't think this is over. I won't let this be the end. I will find Giovanni. And I will resurrect Team Rocket. I will... Until then... Farewell. Alright, Team Rocket has disappeared from this area. And there is the scientist who has the sapphire. I almost managed to sell the sapphire for huge money. Then, you just had to come along and blow the whole deal apart. <laughs> there is no forgiveness for you. Scientist Gideon wants to battle five Pokemon. First up is Voltorb. Oh great, he's an Exploder Man. All right, Jolteon. Let's use Dig. Oh, we actually used Swift. Not bad. Smart play. Probably wanted to wait until I was above ground to explode. Thanks for coming, Voltorb. I'll probably be seeing you again and your evolved form. Next up is Electrode. Yeah, I knew Electrode. Oh, no, I wanted to switch. B button. Why? Can I be faster than it? Yes, let's use Dig. Please explode so I don't take any damage at all. Sonic Boom, okay. That's interesting. None of them have wanted to explode on me yet. Quite weird, actually. Alright, there you go. It's gonna use Charge. Okay, that's weird. I'm actually quite surprised nobody has exploded in this battle yet. Alright, once again, let's use Dig. And that should do it, unless he... Yeah, he's not going to explode, I guess. Hmm. It's weird. I'm not used to Electrode and Voltorb not exploding. <laughs> Alright. Uh, but I'm happy that they're not. Next up is Magnemite. 
we will switch out and we will go into Charizard. And let's use Flamethrower. There you go, thanks for coming Magnemite. Next up is going to be... Magneton! Alright, let's stay in, and after this there will only be one Pokémon left! This battle's going a lot quicker than the first battle did with the Rocket Admin. Alright, Flamethrower to Magneton, going to take it out, quite expected. Thanks for coming Magneton, and the final Pokémon for the Scientist is going to be Porygon! Oh boy! We will stay in... And you traced our blaze? Well, let's give you a blast burn for your troubles. Thanks for coming, Porygon! I'll never see you in the anime... at all. And that is going to do it for this battle... against... Scientist Gideon! Gah! Darn! 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 If I can't sell it, it's worthless! Go ahead! Take it! And we obtain the Sapphire! And that's it! He's just done! He's done! He's done! What does this computer say? A report with graphs and text is on the PC monitor. The influence of magnetic waves on Pokémon evolution. It's too difficult to understand. Hmm. Interesting. Well, we are done with this whole adventure of finding the Sapphire and battling Team Rocket Grunts. So, why don't we head it... Uh, can we actually take a shortcut here? With Polyrath and Surf? No, but there's an item. It's a PP up. Alright, I'll take it. Let's surf across here, head back to the port, and then let's go back to One Island. It's been forever since we've been there. And then we will hand over the Sapphire to Celio. But first, we're probably going to have to heal our... Well, we'll just wait to heal our Pokémon at the Pokémon Center on One Island. I mean, it's not a big deal. Alright, let's head to One Island. Alright. And now that we're back, let's head to the Pokémon Center and give the Sapphire to Celio. So this is the gem that forms a pair with the ruby! James, you've gone through a lot to get this, didn't you? You don't have to tell me. I know it wasn't easy. Thank you so much! Now it's my turn to work for you! Please, give me a little time. Okay, this is good. I did it! I linked up with Lynette! James! James, I did it! I've managed to link up with trainers in the Hoenn region! Finally, the network machine is fully operational! James, I owe it all to you! Thanks to you, my dream came true! You are very welcome, Celio. Alright, let's heal our Pokémon at the Pokémon Center and... wrap things up. Next time on Pokémon Leaf Green, we will head to Seven Island, see if there's anything we can do there, and then, I guess, we will battle the Elite Four and Pokemon League once more. So, thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.